Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. How's it going? Welcome back into another reaction. Mighty here. So far, so good. Another long day, but not completely a drag off. So that is considered a good thing. And just finish up the movie Blade the Immortal that is available on Tubi. Now, all that's left is to double check if Jacko is available so I can make a video out of it. But first things first. There's one request I didn't get a chance to do so, and that was this past Sunday, in which that belongs to EBF, and it's been a while, and I need some laughs. So, I am going to be reacting of the latest episode from Hell of a Boss, Truth Seekers, so I guess that's, um, the truth is out there, that demons do exist. No one... Familiars of the X Files when I when I said the truth is out there. Jesus Christ, I I, I am old. But regardless, let's go ahead and take a look at this. And um, if you are new to this content, all you have to do is click and subscribe, and you get notification from yours truly, the Reaction Man for reaction gaming, music streaming, and anime. And if you have any requested videos that you want me to react, I'll be more than happy to do so for the sake of entertainment. But most of all, this is me just doing my best to bring the entertainment just for you because this is what I love to do. And without further ado, it's time to react. Right there. Was the first <laughs> oh, shot. Definitely from hell. They must use this dark magic to cross over. I'm the sorry, that face. And they seem to be killing specifically targeted people. But why? They always attack at random, all over the country. There's this no voice sounds a little bit of a New Yorker. Oh, oh Jesus! Well, that's convenient. Remember, we can't be seen. Pardon my words, sir, but you're currently being the loudest. I said, shush your dick-sucking lips, Moxie. Damn. <laughs> Compromise. Luna, close it! Wait, no! I <laughs> think <laughs> I smell colors. What? Colors? Back off, you tuxedo wearing fox! Seated suits at corporate corners loses now. That was pretty badass. Super badass. Okay, super badass it is. She's pissed and already in tears. Shit! Shit, shit, shit! Ah! Poor Millie. You, uh, shit. you okay there? What are you doing sitting there? The boys are in trouble! Open it again! Blitz was using a total of zero euphemisms, innuendos, or swears. That means it was serious, which means I don't open it until... Open the fucking portal now! You better do what she says, because she means it. And you're too late. They aren't here! It smells like they went this way. Come on, let's find the dumbass twins. <laughs> dumbass twins. Finally awake, huh, little fella? Your partner has been for a while now. Look, shitbag, it takes a while to see <laughs> oh, right? I took a fuck ton of tranquilizers in the college I dropped out of. Also, I've been strapped nipple first to a oh, so okay. Oh, okay. Tell us, demon scum, who do you work for? Satan? How did you get to our world from the afterlife? Why are you killing humans? When did you show up here? Okay, I'm gonna stop you right there, bitch. First of all, we just woke up from a very nasty shock, and I'm still feeling fucking woozy, so I'm gonna request you fetch us some coffee before we get into this. I mean, everyone gets coffee in shitty movies with scenes like this, am I right? I want That's some iced bitch. That's quite oh, true. I'll have a Neapolitan cappuccino, more cappa than chino. Make sure it's got no more than four ounces of milk. The beans won't have the right texture otherwise. And make sure they spell my name correctly on the cup. They always put Foxy or Roxy. 
you hate that. If you can't handle that, I'll have a venti what traditional. The shit? Please use soy milk with two blonde shots, affogato and ristretto. I'd also love three vanilla pumps at the very bottom, then add the coffee after, then add Enough! Some... We are in That's a one tall wow. order. I was getting massive douche chills just there, Mox. Congrats. If we have to, we are willing to resort to torture methods to get answers out of you nasty hell beasts. When you say tortured, you mean physical or psychological? Physical seems counterproductive. We would likely tell you anything if it meant an end to the pain. And you would have no way of knowing what was true. Or we might like it too much, and then you've got a whole new thing to deal with. What do you mean by that? Ah, you're stupid, huh? I could work with stupid daddy likey duck. <laughs> <laughs> It's hard to resist. I'm really sorry. I mean, considering your approach thus far, you've had us tied here for what hours, and you haven't even had us confirm what exactly we are. What are you? He has a point. Virgo. <laughs> ah! Oh, a smart guy, huh? One more quip out of you, and we'll shut you up. Oh, getting cakey. <laughs> we aren't playing any of vile demon kinks. I mean, what? that's what it sounded like back there. You sickos. <laughs> Don't give them ideas, sir. Why they not? don't look I know the shit very pushovers. We are not getting kicky with you. Calm down, one. Don't let these monsters get to you. Hey, aren't we gonna get our phone call, bitch? Well, that entirely depends. Who are you gonna call? Hmm? Your fat mom begging her for a fat. <laughs> His fat mom is dead. Damn. Did did it just say dorks? I or think so. Dorks. Fuck, this looks intense. How are we gonna get in? Oh, Lift me up to that van. Somehow I think that the. Uh, yeah, I, I don't think they don't look so tough to me. <laughs> oh! Dicey. You know what? I need to stretch my neck. Oh lord. Damn, you're pretty agile for an old lady. I'm like five years older than you. <laughs> but she is flexible. Hey, let's just leave them here until they feel like talking. Don't worry, Mox. If we keep being obnoxious, they'll eventually slip up and we'll get a chance to get out. Let's just keep fucking with them until they get so frustrated they stop thinking clearly it usually works. Mm. Well, that, that's so the demons true. want to play games, huh? Well, we could play games. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Truth bomb. It, is, it also says, She'll be on her way by now. Uh, I'm sure. Juice bitch. She'll be fine, bitch Mox. juice. It would take a roided up hippo to take down that woman when she's upset. We've never dealt with the human government I before. I really don't want she's to go that far about what he just honestly, said there. Shut up about Millie. It's always, Oh, how's Millie? I can't tell you. I'm hanging with Millie. I'm so worried about Millie. And she's always five fucking feet away from you. It's pathetic. Wait, what? It's oddly personal. You know, you're right. I don't know why the fuck I just let my gut spill like that. Oh, uh, it looks like it's starting to work. They're filling this room with something. Fuck. What the hell is this? I think it's some kind of airborne truth telling syrup. Oh, you just guess that's what it is? Um, uh, yes. Just something specific I wouldn't normally tell you. Okay, uh, does Millie ever peg you? Sometimes. Wait, Wh ew. What? what? Oh, I snap. Your suit is tacky. Fuck, I'm sorry. Tacky? How fucking dare you? You have shitty taste in music! <laughs> shitty taste? You said you liked that musical I recommended to you. I lied. I left halfway through. You you said you loved it. It was awful, Moxie. It was about ugly, horny cats. Oh, my God. <laughs> I've said so many lies. <laughs> this is going to be a good night. <laughs> Your fault. How is this my fault? Okay, seriously, what in the hell is going on? Are they experiencing Let's 
Are they experiencing some you. side effects? God, this smells awful. What's that music? Is that you? Is this a prank? Because I swear to say- It Satan is no prank, bitch! <laughs> <laughs> Why do you sound like that? Because you, my precious little bitch boy- <laughs> Oh, <sorry, laughs> you bitch boy! Balls. No, what? How could this be? I've never tried acid shrooms or DMT. It's a bad trip. Oi, Gavalt! Of course, Blitz, this would be your fault. My lungs are full of honesty. Would you promise me that you won't judge? Yes, bitch. <laughs> not trying to too much, but I'm in too deep. So first of all, fuck you! Oh. This is just typical. Well, two can play at this game of dismay, because if you're here causing frustration, I'm torturing you in your hallucination. This was a little trippy. Right up on the, uh, an old style of the, of this type of animation, I guess. I simply follow your orders. What the fuck? Your orders are as nonsensical as a sun. Why is his voice sound like that speaking to a microphone? Why are you talking like that? What the fuck does that even mean? I am simply speaking Satan's plain English. Perhaps you should crack open a dictionary sometime, and then maybe you could understand. Harsh words and glitching. Still mouthing off like that. Shut up! Why do you hurt me so? This looks smooth. Why must you push, push my friends, friends away? Why does it seem like a recurring thing that you alienate with your toxic routine? I don't know. Eventually, everyone goes. Because you're thoughtless and cruel, and you'll end up alone. Ooh, that's a good analogy you there. You don't know what you are doing half the time. And you depend on me and the missus to manage your foolish flights of fancy. Okay, uh, that sounds like a, a bit of a British dare. I remember this cat, and it sucks that Norm is not in this episode. That's really unfortunate. Yet you still shove away anyone who gets too close until they resent you for being a selfish shit. Wow, that is harsh. Stole us. Oh boy. I believe your self-conscious is trying to tell you that you simply cannot fathom proper intimacy, but also craving as well. It's rather unfortunate, sir, considering oh, it's how you treat those who stand by you, such as myself. Are you worried I may have fuck? enough of it one day as well? Stop fucking talking, all of you! <laughs> They're hallucinating. But Blitzos is pretty deep in the. Uh, yeah, it's it's very harsh. Wow. But Moxie, however. Inside. I am scared of rejection. Why, Moxie, why do you have Millie put it in your body? It gives me an erection. No what? Hide. We accept your true feelings, so Shit. promise me that I can do to, to be, be true. true. The world is your anus, so peg it with honesty. Oh. I've been a jackass, it's true. You've been a jackass, but it's true. More like the jackass of the year. I will be a better friend than I was before. Be better at speaking my mind. And together we can begin to become fine that's not bad though that was pretty good <laughs> try one oh my god that's so lame and easy
Do you remember what you said to me after my first day with the company? Not really. I remember. You told me I did a good job and that you were proud to work with me. I feel like you wanted to say something more judgmental, but you said that because I needed it. And it helped. Look, I'm hard on you because I know what you're capable of, Mox. You care too much about what everyone thinks, except for me, because, you know, my opinion is correct. But just keep doing a good job, okay? You shoot and kill good. You escape things easy. You can be strategic and cold-blooded when you need to. And don't expect any more compliments. I'm maxed out. Thank you, sir. You know my name. Use it. Thanks, Blitz. The cavalry has arrived. Impressive work, Mills. How'd you get here all by yourself? Uh, she didn't. That's Let's very true. Let's get it. Nice catch. Oh! Right to the jugular. Sick ass. This is a really good animation right there of the fight sequence. Oh, get wrecked. <laughs> oh, so big. Not a good time, Blitz. So, not a good time. Hey, Mills. Hey, Blitz. Do you need a gun or anything? No, I'm good. <laughs> She's good. Yeah. Oh my God. How about some water? Sure. <laughs> No problem, Billy. Oh my God, she's so relaxed. Quality time with Daddy. Ooh. Okay, I'll say it again. This is this is a great action. That's because you're not very skilled, that's what. Tip dry, and now we're out of badassery. <laughs> you demons are going anywhere now. <laughs> um, what the fuck? Who dare threaten my image? 
humans are you little creatures not being careful up here you know if you get in trouble i get in trouble we don't want that they caught us off guard your highness yeah you can unclench your bird puss dollars it's not gonna <coughs> happen again okay luckily for you most don't believe the word of the demon obsessed lunatics they are seen as kooks <laughs> kooks such a silly word now let kooks. us all return yes please I'd like to get back to the correct hellhole as soon as possible. Am I going to get any thank you for the rescue, Bitsy? Well, I suppose you should. Want me to fuck your brains out tonight? Very much so. All right, but you're keeping quiet or I'm using those bear traps. Oh, please do. Okay. I wish I didn't see that. Wow. Um... Let me just first off to say that that um, quite of a hell of an entrance from St Solas. I mean, Jesus Christ. I mean, I've never in my life so far with the series, I've never seen such a crazy and that such chaotic, demonic entrance that's so that will give nightmares. And lucky for me that I already had that kind of experience before. Um, well, except that the, the the darkness part that that was also kind of felt like it, that your your whole life is being swallowed up, and that was that's pretty steep in my my opinion. But uh, sweet Jesus, that was really something else. Um, <laughs> about the fact that um, the the truth bomb instantly just exposing of what they feel and uh, Moxie's uh, own little 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 world that's got musical and uh <laughs> bitch boy <laughs> oh god oh that just make my night even much better just to hear that but poor Billy. I mean, she's the kind of woman that she will go through the to the ends of the earth just to be with her Moxie. Uh, and she don't care. She will go ballistic. I mean, it's already been established. I mean, just, that just shows you how crazy and, and twisted that she is. But she's so relaxed. I mean, like. She, you know, be, be, I mean, Blitz will ask her, did you want any water? And she go like, sure. And just, just well, I she have her legs, I mean, just have her legs being completely in a lock hold to the neck. I mean, I mean, I just don't want to, I do not want to mess with her, period. But, uh, interesting. So, I guess that that means that... Agent 1 and 2 are not completely over with this. I mean, did, did they not just witness of the of the horrific, of uh, the pure madness that just happened? I mean, I have a feeling that the, the next episode is going to be 
it's going to be an all-out war. And um, this time, maybe they're going to use guns instead of just using weapons that could actually, that, that could hurt unless that they can be, I, I don't know, be blessed to, you know, to be exercised. I mean, using actual proper weapons for, you know, for slaying demons or imps. I'm, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. But, uh, good episode. Definitely have some good laughs there up there. Uh, nice musical. That was very touching. And that was not so bad. And, uh... I felt like there was a little bit of a Phantom of the Opera going on up in here. But I think that's going to be it for right now. So, ABF, thank you for for the heads up and just to show you that I haven't forgot about this. But definitely it was worth just to check it out. So, I think that's going to be it for right now. So, I'm going to go ahead and uh, do my little thing. But if you guys enjoyed that. Let's leave it a likes and also leave a comment down below and I will catch y'all in the next video. So take care guys and be safe.